Hey guys, this is Eddie the Magic Monk. In this video, you're going to learn how to customize the Samsung Galaxy S5 and to get rid of some of the unnecessary features that come with the phone. So you can probably see on your phone that when you are in the main menu and you're scrolling left and right, on your phone and you keep scrolling to the left and you come into this my magazine app and then you can't scroll anymore or you can scroll back out to the main menu but you can't keep scrolling to the left okay now I don't know about you guys but I don't really read this magazine thing that often and basically it's just uh, the same app as the flipboard so it's sort of pointless to have this magazine there so to disable it this is what you have to do so you're going to go to a section of your desktop that has an empty space and you'll keep you're gonna click on it and hold it down and then that will bring you to the editing window where you can edit what icons and what widgets you want on your desktop so what I'm going to do now is go to home screen settings and then I'm going to get rid of my magazine okay so if you get rid of that what happens is if you go back to your um, desktop by clicking the back button and you go left and right then the magazine thing will no longer be there so you can go keep going left as many times as you want and when you go to the leftmost desktop and you go left again it'll just reappear to the desktop on the right hand side now another couple of things that you probably want to get rid of are some of the other widgets that you don't really need in my opinion so you can probably see on your phone that if you go to the lock screen by pressing the power button on and off and on again it already displays the time the date the weather and so on so you don't really need okay you don't really need the um, this huge widget here so to get rid of it all you're gonna do is hold it down with your um, finger and then drag it to remove and then it's gone okay and then in my opinion um, this Google bar is pretty useless as well because um, it takes up a lot of space and if you really want Google okay on your desktop then you can just go to apps and then find the Google icon okay which is over here and drag it to your desktop okay and this does exactly the same thing as that huge widget so instead of clicking on it and then searching things okay you can just search by clicking this little Google icon alright so therefore I'm gonna get rid of this huge widget remove it okay so I have a bit of space on my home screen okay the next thing you probably want to do is get rid of this email icon right because the only thing you need is Gmail right so uh, if you go to apps and just drag your Gmail to your home screen and then you can get rid of this old email um, icon unless you check some other email account in my case I just use my phone to check my Gmail so now your home screen is cleared up and you can just drag a few more icons from your apps to your home screen okay thanks for watching guys see you next time